Our story today is romantic and our heroine is Natalie, a young woman from Los Angeles who is looking for her first love in her life and does this through thousand match applications but unfortunately all her emotional interview fail and she still has not found the right life partner for her. Natalie works as online article writer and writes articles about her love life and her failed interviews but this article surprised Lee the blog manager so much that he said your articles are great content for the site because they attract a lot of audience. This is scary a friend of Natalie who encouraged her to look for her life partner and help her in the application of love so that she met more people from more than one place. Let's start our story. Natalie as she researches the applications find a match between her and handsome young man from a city called Lake Placide in New York state whose name is Josh who writes on his profile that he loves to travel, go out and rock climbing. And they get to know each other and talk to each other a lot morning and night and know each other's favorite thing. How do they live their lives? I mean in short they spend their day from the first time they wake up until they fall asleep while they are together on the phone. Natalie will be so happy but Carrie her friend tell her do not be so happy and take care of yourself because there are many young people who are not really like what they are right about themselves in their profiles that's possible at all that is not the one in the picture Natalie say it you are right Natalie called Josh and say send me picture of you now Josh take a picture and send the picture to her Carrie feels safe seeing Josh picture Carrie says the situation is so good and in a day Josh is talking to her and says I'm upset because there is a great distance between you and me I wish you were close to me Natalie I hope we spend Christmas together Natalie decided to travel to Josh to make him a Christmas surprise and she takes the opinion of Carrie her friend and say it am I right or wrong or what I am I'm confused and I didn't know Carrie telling her she is on the right track Natalie goes to her boss at work and tell him I want a vacation also you should know that I will stop writing articles about my failed romantic interviews because I finally found my life partner Lee asks her have you seen Josh Natalie says she saw him Lee asks her did you meet him or still Natalie says it's still Lee said take your vacation and prepare yourself for your next articles that will keep you strong for a new failed date Natalie says you are annoying by the way when Natalie arrives in Lake Side, she goes to Josh's house and his mother opens the door for her and said hey I am Natalie Josh's friend I am coming today to make a surprise for Josh because he doesn't know I am coming but mom Josh is very happy that her son has a friend or girlfriend and says come in my love and by the way I'm very happy that my son Josh has finally had a girlfriend Natalie is surprised but she doesn't get stuck in her brain. Josh's mother introduced Natalie to Josh's father Bob. He owns a sport equipment store and Josh is working with him in it. She also introduced her to his grandmother Jane. Natalie will be happy with Josh's family because they are so kind and welcome to her. But Natalie is surprised when she found out that Josh's family is surprised that Josh has a girlfriend. Finally they heard Josh's voice outside and his mother says come. Josh quickly and Josh come and Natalie is shocked because Josh is not the Josh in the pictures. This is another one at all. But Natalie didn't say anything so as not to embarrass Josh in front of his family and also so as not to spoil the happiness they felt in the beginning. Outside the house Natalie will be very angry and scold Josh and say you are a cheater and a liar. You made me travel 3,000 kilos to make you a surprise and in the end discover that you are another person? But how did this happen? I checked the photos. What did you do? Tell me. Josh said I said I wish you were next to me. These are words from those who say it to normal between any two who are close to each other. But I didn't say come visit me. As for pictures I'm a strong fan of Photoshop. Come, let's just fear it and to continue our talk. Natty says, I want to go inside and I don't want to see you again. And she leaves him and walks and goes to the cafe to drink juice that calm her nerves. And suddenly Natalie finds a young man in Josh's picture on his profile and feels attracted. But Natalie is tired because the juice she drank had kiwi in it and she is allergic to kiwi. And the Josh is looking for her and finds her unconscious in front of the cafe and takes her to the hospital. And when Natalie wakes up, she tells Josh that she saw the young man who put his picture on his profile. Josh said, it's my friend, his name is Doug. And I really like him and I wish I could be like him. But unfortunately, I am very shy and suffered from failure in my life. I wish I could do something to make my family happy and instead they see me as a failure even my older brother Owen who has nothing to simplify in this word but to make fun of me Natalie said what is my fault why are you laughing at me Josh says I can fix my mistake and introduce you to my friend tag but in return you pretend that you are my love until Christmas end because these two days are two happy days and I do not want to make my family feel sad because of my failure Natalie says yes and Natalie goes home with him and she knows that he makes candles that smell nice and strong he wishes to open a candle 
around the shop but he is afraid of his father's rejection. Natalie content to pretend that she is Josh's girlfriend and feels happy to be with his family and his family will be happy to have her too. On the day Owen, Josh's brother, he and his wife came. Owen likes to take the attention of everyone around him and annoy Josh but Natalie takes the lead for him and annoys Owen. Natalie tells Josh that his brother is an annoying person but Natalie tells Josh that he should take the attention of everyone around him like his brother does. Josh does her advice and they will be at the relatives and Owen is getting ready to sing them the Christmas song like every year but Josh tells them that Natalie and I will sing it together and everyone is surprised. Owen gets very angry and says to them oh I will make you all happy my wife is pregnant. Josh tells them and I will make you happy too and ask Natalie to marry me now. Grandma is happy. She gives them her ring and Josh asks Natalie to marry him. Natalie says what are you doing? But in the end Natalie agrees to marry him because of the embarrassment. Josh gives Natalie tips to get to know his friend Tag and tell her that Tag loves mountain climbing very much and training for it all the time and that she must love this sport too so that Tag can take her climbing with him. Natalie tells him that she has a phobia of heights but Josh tells her not to worry and trains her to climb. Then he takes her to meet Tag in his father's shop and introduces her to him as his cousin. Tag and Natalie talk to each other and Tag knows that Natalie almost loves all the things he loves. He likes her and gives her a date in the gym so that they can claim the truck together and she really goes with Tag and Josh will be with her because this is the first date between her and Tag and if something goes wrong he will fix it. In fact the wrong thing happened which is Natalie climbed the rocks but she was terrified and afraid to calm down. Josh gets out and helps her from over the rocks. Tag admires Natalie's landing style and feels that she is a Campbell of the sport. Natalie says you don't see me climbing mountain, I will blow you away. Tag he said, I invite you to dinner tomorrow in my restaurant, which serves the finest types of meat. And at night, Natalie and Josh will be watching with the family the Christmas movie Love Actually. But Josh's mother surprised them that she posted an announcement of their engagement in newspaper tomorrow. And they ran to steal all the newspaper before people could read them. And at night, Natalie and Tag will be sitting in the restaurant, but Owen, Josh's brother, sees them. The next day, Josh and Natalie went with Josh's grandmother to the nursing home because the grandmother told all her friends I brought you experts in dating on the internet. And Josh's grandmother friends asked them if we went to hide a disease or age, what should we do and write what exactly. But Josh says to them you can lie, but when you lie, think that there is someone on the other side that you will deceive and laugh at, and that's why you will cause a great harm. Natalie likes Josh's words and knows that he really feels guilty for lying to her. They are walking behind Josh's grandmother. Grandma suddenly changes her way, and they think that she is lost for her car. So they go after her and find themselves in the restaurant of Tag and Josh's family throwing them a surprise engagement party. Of course Josh and Natalie will be surprised and Natalie is more surprised when she sees Tag in front of her and says congratulations. He tells her that he feels happy for Josh and that he wishes to see his bride so she says take this clothes and, and put them in the laundry shop. Also Natalie meets her boss and she says what brought you here. He tells her that Josh's brother invite him to the engagement party. Natalie will be very confused and don't know what to do. But Josh's brother Owen stops her and says I think that's how you're Game has been relieved Natalie right you play with my brother and laugh at him and cheat on him with tag I saw you with tag at the restaurant at night I also learned it through the internet that you are working as a writer of love articles I mean my brother Josh for you is just a story on the side nothing more what exactly do you want from my brother but George's father say a word to the guests on the occasion of his son's engagement but Natalie interrupts him and tells them that the wild story is a lie and she says that I have known a young man on the internet for a while and he was nice and funny and he was tag and I decided that I would come and meet him but when I come I knew that he was Josh and I was not able to talk about the matter of make a problem with Josh because it would upset his family who were very happy with him and she tells them that they decide she and Josh they pretend in front of his family that they are in a relationship until the end of Christmas and Josh helped her get to know Tag and told her about it, the thing he loves of course Tag hears this and he feels surprised and he says it I mean you are upset with Josh because he deceived you and you did that with me right I mean you don't like rock climbing Natalie. Natalie told him, no tag. Tag get upset and walk. Josh's family will be very upset about what happened. But when they go home, they all console him. When Josh goes to his room, he finds that Natalie lit his candle. And she left his grandmother ring and a piece of paper written to him that she had left his life and that he had to stick to his dreams. And that he also has to change his profile and not try to impersonate someone and be himself. And he will definitely find the person who will like him. Josh goes to his father and says, I have to leave the shop and open the project with my own 
some candle shop, which my grandfather taught me how to do. Shush father, he likes a candle, and he say, I agree, my love. And he laughs and says, as for their store, you were not really good at working with me, and the customer were leaving because of you. Natalie will be sitting in the coffee of the hotel she stayed in with her boss. Natalie's boss at work, he says, there is something very confusing, and I want to understand. Natalie asks it, what is it? He says it, when you discovered the trick, why did you keep sitting here? Why didn't you come back? Natalie says, I wanted to come back to you with a story because I haven't written for a while. He told her, no, not that reason. You are always late in your article. And after all your relationship before that, you are with the first flow you found, you end the relationship. This time is different, Natalie, right? She told him, I don't know. Natalie is going to write an article about her emotional experience, but she will be very confused and do not know where to start. After much thought and a lot of coffee, Natalie decided to write her story in detail. But as she writes, she sank with herself about the word of Lee, her boss. And while she's sinking, a message appears in the application. Just changed his profile and put picture of himself and drove and said, I hope to find someone who loves me as I am. Natalie decided to go to Josh's house and announce her love for him in the manner of the movie Love Actually. Josh will be very happy and his family will also be happy and live together happily and with that we have come to the end of our story don't forget to subscribe